Hello and welcome to the Anthony Walker Show. I'm going to be talking to a variety of local people, including my family and my social worker. We're here in the town of Worksworth in Derbyshire. The town was founded in 835 AD as listed in the Doomsday Book. The town has a variety of old pubs, including the Red Line Hotel and the Royal Oak Inn. I recently spoke to Zoe, my social worker, about her opinion about the Euros and how it has affected the pandemic. Do you think, as the fuck, do you think, ah, football's brought people together, or is it dangerous with the restrictions being eased? <laughs> Well, my opinion is it's dangerous. Mine too. Yeah. I can't go to my son's sports day. <laughs> but they yeah. can all hold and squeeze yeah. each other. Yeah. I think it's dangerous, Anthony. Yes, I do. With all yeah. those crowds of people not wearing masks. A lot of them probably aren't vaccinated. Wow. I don't think you have to be tested, do you, to go into the ground? So I, don't, I, don't think, I don't know. I think you do, actually. I do. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I spoke with James Moore, a 21-year-old photographer with both autism and OCD. I'm here with James Moore, a 21-year-old photographer with both autism and OCD. Hello. So, first question. What's it like living with autism? There are good points and bad points. I like living with it because it's part of who I am, but I can. it can be difficult because I find it hard to make friends and socialise. But sometimes I don't don't always know the right thing to say and this might appear rude to some people. I get anxious about new things and change. As I can see, do you think the opportunities for autistic people to get work are good enough? No, there's not enough support to help you and not enough employees understand autism. My advice is to be yourself. Um, do you have any interests or passions? Um, my advice is to never get and keep trying and my passion is photography. Have you lost any friends or relatives to COVID? No, I haven't. Oh, oh thank you, God. When you say photography changed your life, what exactly do you mean? It gave, it gave me a way to express myself and my feelings instead of talking. It gave me hope and the purpose to wake up the next day. Wow. Do you have any advice to young photographers? Always be true to yourself. Take lots of photos and experiment and express yourself. Keep practising. Learn from others who have experience in their field. Where can people find your work? People can find my work on Instagram at james.morephotography. Thanks for talking to, to me, James, and good luck for the future. Thank you. You too. Well, that's all we've got time for this week. Thanks to everyone who participated. Don't forget to follow us on YouTube. See you next time on The World of Anton Walker. Ooh.